You may believe she was next. Darling, is that you? Yes, darling, it's me. Although I can't see you, somehow something deep inside me tells me that you're there. Darling, I'll always be there. You will. Darling, promise you will. Of course I will. You know, it's funny, lying here. It makes one think of all sorts of things. Did you remember to get your pink dress from the cleaners, love? No, I forgot. Oh, I don't know. You'll forget your head one of these days. You will, really. The man made me forget. What man? The man in the raincoat on the cemetery. On the cemetery? On the cemetery? I thought I told you never to go there. What did he do? Nothing. What do you mean, nothing? He, he didn't touch you, did he? What do you mean? Did he... Did he touch you? No. Well, not really. What do you mean? Did he touch you or didn't he? No, he didn't touch me. But what did he do? Did he show you anything? What sort of thing? His... Did he show you his legs? Oh, yes. Oh, my God. I saw his legs all right. Now, tell me what happened. I'll kill him. Where is he? Is he still there? Mum, tell Mr. Turns to go to the police station. Oh, no, he's not there now. Well, where is he, then? He ran away. Ran away? The brick nearly hit him. What brick? Did you throw a brick? Oh, no, the boy did. The boy with the green ears and the ginger moustache with the spear running through his head, wearing frogman's flippers with a machine gun. This is no joke, my girl. You put the fear of God into me. It's a good job your father's not here. You'd get a bloody good hiding. That's the most wicked thing I've ever heard. Now you can go to your room. You're getting a bit too lippy. I must have had my mouth washed out with soap and water if I told fibs like that at your age. Goodness knows I should. He's not got green ears at all, Gwen. He's quite a nice boy, really.